All right. Welcome to Masaba. This poor little guy, he undocked in a pod, and I was like, hey, nobody's undocking with me. I'm going to sneak back in to dock and undock with my, uh, my Asmos and get away. And yeah. That's exactly what happened. So, yeah. It's a thing. So, <laughs> it's a kickout station. It's awful. Once when you're on docking, you're pretty much instantly um, past uh, zero meters, and you have to. Yeah, it's it's horrible. So the problem is, how do you do it when you've bought something cheap here, right? When you've gone, hey, this is a great deal I've gotten. It's only in low sec. Let's go there and grab it and, you know, no problem. If I undock I'll, and there's trouble, I'll just redock. Well, yeah, this is a thing. Now, the solution is, of course, to make an undock. And if you've never made an undock before, well, welcome to it. You know, you're about to be shown how to how to figure it out. So that kind of is an undock. Let me get. All right. So he's got an undock warp position. He's just waiting for his weapon timer to cool, go come off, cool off, cool, cool down, so he can dock again probably, and start the whole process all over again. So what I do is I'll get in a position just below this area and then double click on my on the way down. Now they've kindly left a holler wreck there. <laughs> so I'm gonna take advantage of that. And I'm going to warp to it at ten. And that way, and cloak up, and head down, and that way I should be able to get in position easy enough. Pushing my luck, but I think I could probably get away with doing it. Right? So, approach. Yeah, it's, uh, they're pretty much all docked up. There's nobody in this one, and there's nobody in that one. And, yeah, they're just waiting for customers, that's all. Oh, Panther, looks like somebody's blopsing. Looks like they found a target. And off they go. See ya. Yeah, they found a target. So, perfect. Now, the nice thing about cloaking, see, watch this. I can cloak up, right? I can hit cloak, and within a few seconds, you can hit my warp drive, and it'll actually activate. If you wait a little bit longer, it'll tell you you can't do something while cloaked, but, yeah. So, we'll double-click downwards, and we'll, we're using a tactical camera. And what we'll do is we'll get in position so we can actually see... The undock, there we go. And where's my ship? Okay, there. So all I need to do is get myself... Nope, I don't want to approach it. I want to go that way, thank you. So here I go. And my speed is 872. Normally it should be 667. Uh, 666. <laughs> Too bad I can't get it that speed. Um, without implants, I could take a drug if I wanted to, but eh, I'm going fast enough. Uh, I've got snake implants. 
I actually should have bought uh, uh, Overclocker. That would have helped, right? And it's worth it. You're spending uh, good iskies. Right about now. Double click downward. There we go. Make sure I've got it exactly. Actually, I'm a bit, I'm a bit off. Maybe. Give me a sec. Oh, hey, got it. Yeah, wee bit off. Is that even... That's in the middle, right? I'm sure that's in the middle. Yeah, right. That should be exactly in the middle. I'm trusting. Get that crosshair right there. And yeah, I need to get over there a little tiny bit. I'm not clicking, double clicking the station. Yeah, if I'd taken a drug, say the 5% overclocker, which is too expensive. It would be one, two, five. I'd be going five. I would be going nine hundred. So that's pretty good. Busy little bees. Looks like they they killed something next door. Actually, so <laughs> that's pretty funny. It's just, yeah. <laughs> All right, so off I go. Jesus, that's a hoot. All right, close enough horseshoes and hand grenades. I'm double clicking in that direction. I don't really have alt, so I'll get rid of uh, either preview. Yeah, if you've got uh, Omega Clients, it is the best thing since sliced bread. As long as you set it up right. When I first got it, when I first tried it many years ago, uh, I did it wrong. Oh, so wrong. And I hated it. Um, but yeah, I saw a friend do it up right with little thumbnails embedded in, in the larger screen. And I'm like, I love this. So, haven't looked back. Yeah, I used to cascade all my windows, like four clients. I used to have four Omegas back in the day. And I would <laughs> cascade them across uh, Windows, Windows 98. So I've got my grandma to dock up a, a frigate at Masaba. And I'll be undocking her. Or getting her to undock. <laughs> use a use one of uh what is it uh 
Downton Abbey grandma's sayings play it whenever I talk about her. <laughs> I'd be a horrible spy. I could never get into the role play. All right, we're in position. We're going down. Awesome. Oh yeah, you don't want to be like Zanny Puff. It, he did it so well too. He undocked in a pod and was like, "Okay, nobody's undocking with me. Great." <laughs> Talks up, they're all asleep, yay. And then he's on Dr. Maya's most, and they're like, Party! <laughs> Poor guy. He did, he did, he tried to do everything right. Right? That he could. Anyhow, anyway, maybe he's an alpha, right? So he doesn't know any better. And... Is there a Maya's most I can by to avenge his spirit i mean my grandma goodbye sorry i don't get it right ships located station only show available at station filter by train skills because you know all right, what we got here? Wow, what a selection. They are really trying to sell hard here, aren't they? <laughs> it's so funny. Look at all the great deals you can get here. Oh, it's awesome. And who... Oh, look at that great deal. <laughs> I And I'll bet you dollars of donuts there's no warp course being sold here. <laughs> warp course stabilizers. Wow, that is a really good deal. I am going to snap up on my eyes most. Thank you. And could I get some warp core stamps? <laughs> you, wouldn't, you wouldn't have to have any of those or, or say, um, uh, hull upgrades for, you know, trying to get away. Uh, how about nanofiber? How about nanofibers? Oh, wow. You've got nanofibers for sale. How much are those? Okay, they're really expensive. <laughs> All right. Okay, maybe not. All right. <laughs> hey, guys. Get with the deal. This should be a really good, you know. <laughs> Reinforced and a fiber. Propulsion. Propulsion upgrades. Maybe. Maybe. Propulsion upgrades. Warp core stabilizers. My goodness. How, how much are they? <laughs> oh, what do you know? Ten times the price. Oh, you can. You guys could do better than that. <laughs> or Chris Dev. Whee! <laughs> Buy one of those. <laughs> the price you've chosen, 1,000% above regional <laughs> average. <laughs> okay, then. Um, and... Just for shits and giggles, I've got the damage control. Uh, of course, cheapest on the market. Excellent, excellent. Oh, damage control two. Yeah, cheapest on the market. Might as well. They are really cheap, right? And I have the skill to use it. Yay! I mean, my grandma has the skill to use it. Right, right. Get it right. <laughs> right. I know I'm horrible. Um, let's see, so damage control, nanofibers, let's see, type D restrained, only got one here, meh, uh, how many, we got one at a cheap price, uh, but that's it, screw it, I'll just buy nanofiber too, they're not that expensive for tech 2 items, so yeah, go for it. Um, uh, 
I shall name this Neener Neener. Neener Neener. I mean, my grandma will name it. Right, right. <laughs> my grandma will open up a fitting screen <laughs> on her slow-ass grandma-like laptop. Ugh. Ugh. I hate laptops. Right. Four low slots. Damage control. No, wait. Back, back when grandma was my age, damage controls used to be active. And warp core stabs used to be freaking passive. Wankers. All right, so I'll buy one more nanofiber. More. Now, alpha can't fit cloaks. So, I'm just not going to freaking bother. I will get shield, though. I mean, I might... I'll get away easy. No problem whatsoever. Um, and there's no... I mean, my grandma will. Sorry. Grandma will get away easy. And they don't have any combat probes out, so they're not going to get my uh, undock warp point, which I am now... See, I am a good 700 by now while I was yapping my face off to you guys. And, you know, that's going to be good enough. I mean, they warp down quite far, um, and they might have varied, they ha might have staggered. They could say, they could look at their uh, bookmarks all the way down that track and go, yeah, we'll just warp to there and catch you, right? So there's that. So this could be a, a lesson in, you know, getting beyond, like, getting a bookmark for Undock well beyond off-grid, right? You get an off-grid bookmark. That way they can't immediately look at their bookmarks list and go, oh, okay, I need to warp that far down to catch catch you, right? Because you'll be off-grid and safe. Well, except for, you know, combat probes. And at this speed, it's going to take forever to get off-grid because you need to be at least 10,000 kilometers, right? So, yeah, it could take a while. I mean, you could, I mean, theoretically, you could just go to sleep and come back in the morning and voila, you've got your off-grid uh, um, safe spot. Yeah. If you happen to get caught and, and have bought something really valuable, and yeah. So let's check. Let's go and check our undock direction just to make sure that we're not screwing it up big time where are we oh i'm drifting way nope nope i'm perfect right excellent yay and let's just uh, scroll back up just to make sure like am i doing it right or am i totally screwing it up right so here's the center of the station and if we go down through the what the, okay, you, I thought I got rid of you. I hate. Okay, I've got a right mouse button. Well, I set it the way I wanted to. Uh, how about middle mouse button? I never hold that sucker down. I just press it to, um, to stop, right? Okay, so, uh, that's better. That's what I shall change it to. See how that goes. Oh, I hate the radio. Oh, it drives me nuts. Okay, uh, what, wait, wait, what, what, okay, perfect, hey, that's a good way to do it, all right, so where are we, okay, a little bit over, yeah, it just felt like this was just, right, I mean, is it, is it perfect, or is it just off kilter, is this, like, it felt like that crosshair was just a tiny bit off, which is really weird, right? You'd think everybody would... Ev pfft, everything would be symmetrical, but I guess not. Like, what is it basing that off of, right? Like, why does it have that shiny thing? Strange, isn't it? Let's 
No, no. Get it up. Okay, I'm going to use this and say, okay, where am I? There did I go. There I am. Okay. So, if I'm there, I need to go a little... Now, this is the problem. Am I... If I double-click here, will I... I'll see myself turn around. So, I'm going to... God, this is probably going to approach the station, but can I do that? Okay, I'm not turning around, right? And I'm going away from it. Oh, okay. Phew. I was worried I was going to approach the station. So there you go. I mean, that is about... As close to perfect as I can get it, and I need to go that away to get to the center. And once I get there, I'll just go straight down, and then I just finagle it from there. Because remember, you're always the it's it doesn't have to be absolutely one hundred percent perfect. It just needs to be straight down enough, because you're going to undock and be aimed in a on an angle you've seen it you're kind of like akimbo from the the undock uh, angle and you're kind of like going off in some random direction in this cone of undocking you've seen it you know what i'm talking about so no matter what you're going to be aimed away from that point regardless but as long as i make it you make it in the center and get that alignment right you'll only have to turn a tiny bit, which is pretty much insta-warp. Trust me, I've tried it a million times. And this is the way to do it. Okay, while I'm doing that, uh, all right, let's get Grandma getting some uh, mid slots, huh? No, because she's alpha, alpha client, alpha state, um, no shield, so it's pointless trying to shove on a. Uh, Mike warp drive onto the Masmos. I think only the nearest can do it. So we're not even going to bother. Um, how much power you got? Yawn. How are we doing here? That's close enough. I'm going to double click down. There we go. Awesome. Now let's get closer. Whoop. Whoop. Wait a minute. That's odd. Give me a second here. I'm going to turn around and look up. So where the heck? I go that away. And I'm right here. Ugh. Well, it, it looks legit, right? Well, I'm going too fast. Slow down. Yeah. It looks legit, and I wonder why that weird crosshair of the lights is off by a bit. 
right? <laughs> what are you up to? Okay, you cloaked. Scary, scary. It's like, did I decloak? What's going on? No. Just somebody lying in wait. I guess I'm too far away to get... to jigger with it too much with the undock. Alright, there we go. Perfect. Ugh. So yeah, it's just a wee bit off. How strange. Huh. See if I can fit Grandma with a a large shield extender, which I can. Okay, cool. There. Right. All good in the hood. Are you selling large shield extenders for cheap at Saba? outrageously outpriced. It's the large compact. Are you selling those for cheap here? Not really. But, yeah, there's a cheap... Meh. Meh. Might as well. I don't want to spend too much on this thing. It's going to redock. That's 101% over... Oh, no. Fit to active ship. Yeah, if they catch me, I'm dead. For sure. My only hope is I activate the warp core and get back to dock in order to dock up. And I have to make a, a combat dock uh, bookmark so I can warp uh, the hauler back and be instantly able to dock. Otherwise, uh, this is going to go nowhere. Do do do. Almost ready. How far am I down? Ooh, that's pretty sexy. One thousand. Still on grid though. Now, if I was feeling brave, what I would do is I would hit the micro warp drive and uncloak hit the warp warp drive, and just start heading down. And if anybody, you know, warps, well, the thing is. That, uh, that all they would have to do is warp, uh, say, a Stratios, right? Or a bomber, even. Um, they could warp a bomber down just in front of like Because I'm going right down, right? So it's not hard for them to set bookmarks. You can warp a bomber right in front of me or below me and just wait till I get close and just decloak and get me. I could try to cloak up. But it's not hard to figure out which direction I'm going. I could turn and get away. But yeah, they would have to be real close to, to get me, and they'd be close enough to decloak me, and yeah. 
game over. I'm obviously overthinking, way overthinking this. They are just used to people who are lazy. I mean, Zanny, the Zanny Puff did it smart, but not outside their capabilities. I'm spending the time, which most people don't, so they're, they're just not used to it, right? I'm sure it happens, but it happens so rarely that most of their victims are easy kills. <laughs> That's... Yeah. And they kill them so quickly and gank their pod that they don't have a chance to uh, really smack in local. Besides, why uh, scare the rest of their victims stocked up? station right hoping they all go away Do-do-do. Yeah. Perfectly straight down. Grandma has no more money left, and I'm not willing to share any of mine with poor old Grandma. Neener Neener is ready to undock, and there are... How many docked? There are eight guests, twelve in local. <laughs> we know what Stradio's cloaked up, so that accounts for one of them. I'm one of them. So that's 10. There's two others, right? Probably cloaked up watching. One of them, we have definitely one, at least one cloaked up uh, scout watching the undock because they saw the pod undock and then they saw the Mazmos undock and that's when they undocked a ganker. So pff, it's, yeah. Not a lot of people do that. Most people just undock as in their ship. So... I'm just guessing here. It's all pure guess. It could all be like all YOLO stuff. Yeah, I mean, I think this is good enough. What I... The plan is... Um, to use, like, always, if if you're an alpha, you don't have this choice. And, obviously, you don't have a cloaky device like this to be able to do it. Alright? Or the patience. So, what you do is, as soon as you undock, you'd hit... Um, I use my middle mouse button to stop. But yeah, do the combo or whatever the control space or go into escape settings and change it to the middle mouse button. Soon as you think you're undocking, spam that stop button. And you want to get in position right in the middle of that dock and then double click down and hit your mic warp drive. Or, since it's Misaba and the chances are you're going to die pretty soon, um, you'll want to just double click downwards, hit that MWD, and they are going to warp 
close to you and pop you. So, yeah, you'd have to be really lucky and catch them when they're sleeping. And it, it happens, right? It totally happens. Um, and you could get a instant grip mark way down there using a frigate. So it's, it's definitely possible. And you saw how I lined it up. So as you're traveling down, you have all the time in the world, well, hopefully, to uh, go into tactical mode, look at that station, and then finagle yourself into that position of, you know, where... Right here, and then right-click and drag, and get yourself right... See that? Get yourself looking at that pyramid right here. There we go. Line that up and go downward a bit. Downward a bit. Downward a bit. And there we go. And right here, as, as long as you can see this, just see your... You can, uh, see, get your ship clicked on, and it, if it's down here, double click that way. And you won't approach the station, as you saw. You'll just drift in that direction and then you know get it kind of aligned and as soon as you're close enough double click downwards and voila you are traveling and since you're going really fast in a little frigate and you're crossing your fingers hoping you don't get popped and be ready with a control bookmark control b bookmark because if somebody does get close to you and it's tart and is about to be if they get within a hundred or 200 and they warp down just just control b right there and keep going and control b a little bit more and yeah you'll get popped probably but at least you'll get a partial like you'll get at least an undock bookmark for your purposes hopefully you've got it lined up and it's straight downwards and you'll have to go with that and you'll have to pray that it works and that you can use your warp course stab uh, to get away before they they pop you. And it, you could be insta-popped, um, but hopefully you've got enough buffer that your yeah, that your that your warp course stab active, acti you can activate it. You have to activate it to make it work. Um, it'll be plus two and hopefully that'll be enough to get away scot-free. And of course, once you do so, you still got to navigate through to high sec, through those low sec areas. So, yeah, it's um, it's it's not a thing you want to consider doing lightly. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not something to be done. But you, if you're lucky, you can get away with it. And there are two routes out of low sec. There's a short way, and then there's a long way. Maybe the long way isn't camped like the short route is, but maybe it is. They've always like these people are like cockroaches. They're freaking everywhere. Um, so, and this is their home. This has been home for, geez, I don't know how long, but a really long time. Like, how old is their alliance? Like these guys have been around forever. They were corporation was made in only 2019 well i'll be a son of a gun domain research mining was created 2015 all right so arton arton was definitely 2015 so that was almost 10 years ago there you go so they been around here smack in local undock or local chat uh, at the undock for almost 10 years now Probably longer, you know. I doubt it, but probably longer. Um, like, how old is this character? Uh, there he is. How old is he? You know. Uh, okay, yeah. So, say 2017. Somebody decided to own this place hard, and they have. And they get so many kills. Let's, uh... Since we're here, might as well check it out. Um, top. 
all time top. Look at that, almost 200,000 kills. Crazy. And top, st top, st top system, Miss Saba, by a, by a long shot. And there's Arton, right? So, yeah, they control this area, for sure. Wow, look at that. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Salmoner, Teshcat, Mamet. Yeah, it's, I think Mamet's, yeah, Mamet's next door. Beefy is, I think, on the route to, you know, getting to High Sack and then Gamadi. Like, let's, let's just, let's check it out. Uh, <laughs> yeah, um, boop. So, Beefy. And Gimati, right? Oh, Yong. All right, my bad. Where are you? Were you the person who cloaked up? You certainly were. Don't know what. Uh, probably you went to Doc. Do 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 do. Two thousand. Woo! Yeah, I think we're done here. 2000 is good enough for, for testing purposes. I mean, I'm never going to get to past Undock, and I don't want to, you know, diddly around uncloaking and hitting the mic warp drive all the time, right? Whee! And there he goes. Went down 1000, right? And he's going to cloak up, of course. What are you doing? Are you testing the waters too? You're going, hey, is it safe for me to undock? <laughs> is it safe for me to... I'll go up and dock and... Is this a pattern? I think he docked. He's like, oh, it's safe now. Oh, God. Is this what happens all the time? People are trying to be smart. It's like, I think it's safe. I think I could go for it. <laughs> oh, Jesus. How am I going to see another one? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. Well, he's in the mag. And watch. Somebody, <laughs> they'll try to get him. Is he going to... Does he have an insta... No, he doesn't. He'll probably get away. He's just a frigate, right? How long was he in dock waiting to get away? Off he goes. Oh. You go, little guy. All right, never, and safe spot. Undock. Yeah, only like 2,000-ish. Ish. Not, not an acceptable bookmark, but it'll do. Oh, yeah. All right, so I'm going to wait, because if I decloak now, they'd be like, oh, he made his bookmark right there, right? So I'm going to chill for a bit. Hello. Do, 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 do. Wait, has he got salvagers or something? No, he's going straight up. Yep, see? Oh, <laughs> uh, he's, he's probably... He could have docked by now. He's probably getting set up right there. He's probably... I'm just going to camp right there. Yep. That's what I do. I mean, like, yeah, I'm just going to sit here as far as up as I can go and just, you know, stab somebody in the back as they come out the door. Bap.
Somebody's bored. Yeah, so I figure as long as I'm like 200 kilometers from the bookmark when I decloak and bugger off, right? I should be uh, good to go, right? It'll throw them off by a bit. But I'm sure they won't be paying attention when I decloak and warp. I'll align to another bookmark. The temporary one I had set up. Yeah, a little bit of patience, right? And it's only taken, what, uh, I'm assuming half an hour for me to make this video. From the moment uh, Zanny died. Or is it Zany? I don't know. Do, 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 do. I'm assuming it's a take on Danny Boy, right? Oh, they scooped. They, sc <laughs> they, <laughs> they scooped his corpse. Okay, not. Okay, it's any fun. Yeah, my memory sucks. Man, nobody docked there, and nobody docked there. Yeah, they're all docked there. Nom, nom, nom. He sure likes warping to there, doesn't he? Alright. Uh, I think he's going to sit there. This is perfect. I will use this to say Nino Nino to him. And we're going to align there. Wait till I get 75%. Decloak and warp. And the nice thing about the endurance. It's instant, right? You you don't have to pick up speed. I can decloak F2 and warp. So I'm going to hit F2 and warp. F2 and warp. And then I need to cloak up again, but I'll hit my warp drive, right? Double click in this direction. Oh, cool. Look at that. I can cloak up right away. So cloak. Decloak. Hits that. Do, 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 and probably don't have any combat probes. All right, we are ready. Here we go. So what's going to happen is I'm going to form a fleet with my grandma. And grandma is going to undock after I choose flag exempt from warp. So, my ship is exempt from warp, see? That red thing. And now, I don't warp, but I can command an undock. Now, all I have to do is wait till my fleet mate undocks, and I see that purple thing. Just make sure I see the... Uh, Oh, uh, I can see it here. I hope. No, I don't. Um, I want to... I'm sure that will show my guy as well. It's... <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna make sure. I'm gonna put Doc to see there. Because I know I have my fleet members showing here. I hope. It's just... Make sure. Don't want to screw up. So... Ships. Select all. It's not like I have a Lancer ship. And then I go, exceptions. And I go, don't show anything. Uh, is in your fleet. Perfect. So we're just going to save that. And we're going to get ready to warp fleet. And I just hit on dock. And then as soon as the squad leader sees the purple, you just click this. Now, I don't have a insta dock, so I'm going to be in a little bit of trouble. But, I, oh, and then bam. 
warp and I'm not even loaded yet so I'm gonna try to get away grandma's gonna try to boot it to the Sun at a hundred warp to within a hundred and I cross my fingers nobody's warping after her And that, that's how you do it. Whee! Off I go. Neener, neener. And I'll just come back and dock. And I would highly not warp, I recommend not warping to the Fortisar because, yeah, they have control of the Fortisar. They can just turn off your access and your tethering and stuff. Just poof, gone. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look. Uh-oh. He'd probably get away. Zip. Alright. I'm gonna warp to station and dock. Actually, I'm gonna warp to station. And... Try to get a bookmark. Graham is going to do something brave. Now, I don't have a mic warp driver afterburner, so... Be putt 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 for a bit. There I am. So I'm just Grandma's just shy of Doc, so I'll tootle into Doc, and hopefully I can get a bookmark before I get shot at. He's only 34 from me, so he's definitely gonna take a shot. Yeah, targeting. Targeting, not targeting. Whee. You're letting get me a bookmark? Yes, please. Thank you. Targeting me, not shooting yet. They probably they probably think I'm just trying to bait them, or for whatever reason, right? They're like, "What's he doing? Getting combat bookmark, guys." That's what I'm doing. Do, 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 do. And ideally, they there's a combat mode, but why they do it at the top of the station is as far as possible away from undock, right? So it's a smart thing to do. I don't think they'll let it, me get away with it. Or my grandma, let, <laughs> let my grandma get away with it. But I will try angle up towards the top of the station. Oh, Grandma, aim a bit more. Aim better. Be better.
Oh. Time to hit that dock. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Time to time to dock up here. Boop. Docking. All right. Close enough. Horseshoes and hand grenades. And yeah, combat bookmark almost. Rubber. Rip. Right, warp, keep, spam the warp, spam the warp, spam the warp. There you go. You're off. And docked. Yeah, you just have to wait out your weapons timer and you can dock. And there. That's how you do it. Um, I'm just going to... Get Grandma to clone jump out of there and do something useful elsewhere. Um, later, but yeah, we're done here. Um, I'll job's done here, so I don't need to be here with this ship. Um, I could. Uh, the reason I use the endurance is because it actually can go faster uh, than the prospect. Which will go 800 versus 872. So it's slower, but why not get that extra eight, uh, 72 meters per second, right? And then if you take the drug, you'll be 920-ish meters per second. So yeah. And of course, I'll uh, link this. And yeah, if, if you're an alpha, um, yeah, how are you going to get, if you're lucky enough, you could get a frigate there with a mic warp drive and just do that. Just get your undock, and that way you can get your bigger ship. If, if you're foolish enough to buy a bigger ship at, at Masaba, um, you could. I mean, it, it might be fun. But yeah, they are. Yeah. They've always got a hard on for, for ganking stuff here because, right? That's what they do. Um, and of course, you could get like mid grade snakes instead of uh, high high grade because they are quite expensive and take the drug and stuff right high speed maneuvering i, I believe increases oh it's the it's the hyper hyperlink that increases the speed for uh mic warp drive and afterburner so hyperlink um evasive maneuver is helpful get up to speed more acceleration and then yeah mid-grade snakes will do it right yeah, and every once in a while, if you feel daring enough, just decloak, hit that mic warp drive, and then cloak up again when you think there's danger nearby. And just uh, keep doing bursts of that and head down and get past the the uh, the ten thousand k barrier and get yourself off grid. It it could be it, the distance varies, but yeah, your mileage could vary. Anyways. Hopefully that was uh, helpful. Okay. And I'm out. Have yourself a good one. Let's see if I can get the high sec safely, huh? Uh, I'm, I'm sure they don't have any gate campers. They typically don't, right? I mean, <laughs> why gank something, somebody on the way to Misaba? Kind of. Bite in the hand that feeds, right? Come into my parlor. Say the spider to the fly. Bye bye, Miss Abba. And get a riddance. Yeah, I've made videos in the past about this. Uh, like uh, using, say, uh, an oversized 
uh, mic warp drive on a stabber, say, and do it that way. Uh, not as agile, obviously, uh, but yeah, it can get you up to really fast speeds as an alpha. Um, and any old little frigate will do, right? And yeah, that's how you make uh, undocks. I'm sure you, it, this will be helpful for you in any situation where you need an undock and you have a frigate and fast fast mic warp drive and now you know how to line up the, the undock. And a lot of undocks uh, horizontally will have the undock, funny enough, along one of these compass lines and you just double click in the center of that and bam you're you're off to the races right so yeah go to sleep wake up bam off grid bookmark and no nothing yeah why would they why would they uh, prevent people from getting to uh, their item Do, 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 do. And hi, sec. Um, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, have you guys have yourselves a good one? I'll probably see it today in another random video that I thought, hey, I'm gonna better make a video about this mechanic. But yeah, I don't think I can stream that anymore, streamline that video anymore than what it is. Uh, because you know, you might have thought, hey, I could use this crosshair of lights to get myself aligned and unfortunately yeah modeling being the graphics department being <laughs> being the way it is that that wasn't a good one so yeah find that pyramid go down a bit and voila see ya <laughs>